We are coming to you live from the nation's capital where the Barton University Bellas are performing for the President of the United States on his birthday. I came in like a wrecking ball. Oh no, she has no underwear on. Oh She's God. turning. In Pitch Perfect 2, the Bellas are three-time champs, but we get kicked out of the ICCAs. The Bellas are hereby suspended from competing at the collegiate what? level. And they have to win back their place in the acapella pantheon. I will do whoever it takes in order for us to get back to the top. You mean whatever it takes? Yeah, I'll do that too. But if we win the world, will you reinstate us? No American team has ever won. That's because they hate us. The whole world. <laughs> The whole world hates us. You really become the underdogs once more, going into this world championship where we meet these new rivals, the German team. Das Sound Machine is the most renowned a cappella group in the world. Baden Bellas, you are so tiny. We're gonna kick your ass. Never trust a big button, smile, that girl is always on. Here we go, yo. They are just like machines, and they're crazy hard to beat. Please just retire. Did your accents get thicker? Is that like an intimidation thing? Because World War II, oh. boom. The first movie was about them coming together, and this film is about the legacy that you leave behind. When I look back on this, I won't remember performing and competing. I'm going to remember you weirdos. The stakes are so much higher, and so the musical performances are just huger. Is that even a word? Who run the world, girls? The dancing is like so much better. Everybody just goes for it in this one. It's a true testament to the first film, and I'm very proud of this movie. They're gonna look at Team USA and be like, why is the most talented one Australian? We run the world, girls! We run this mother, girls! girls.